Can you mess this guy light us up? No! Oh man, we gotta land back down. Jeez, the least top of cheese. Oh man, there's my next target. I see him. I see him. However, let this reload for a second. We're gonna pop out. Light him up. Come on, baby. Light up this mirror mask. Come get him. Come on. Boom! We can get Titan Slayers. That's what I'm talking about. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, whatever time it is in your neck of the woods, this is Tony, and welcome to today's video. So today we're going to be talking about the puncher weapons, the best weapons in the game currently, in my humble opinion. Um, and also going to tell you how you can get your hands on these weapons for free. Um, these are a high-end luxury tier 4 uh, weapon for the heavy class. It is the heavy version of the Shredder. Shredder is the light version. Ooh, getting that first kill on that Orochi Skidoshi like it's nothing. Um, shout out to all the Outjune players. I've been seeing a lot of Outjunes out on the battlefield. I hope you guys have been enjoying it as much as me. It is a very, very fun, very, very effective setup, and it's very, very satisfying to play. All right, we're going to back up into this corner right now to try to keep ourselves safe and Oh man, as I say that, we get this Sonic Orochi in our face. This is no bueno, no bueno, no bueno. All right, so in the top right corner, I'm going to put a link to the 200 Puncher giveaway. This is going on until the end of the month. You can enter on this video, you can enter on that video, and you can enter on every single video I post from that video until the end of the month. Um, I will also put the instructions up on this screen so you guys can see, so you can enter on this video as well. But please go check out the original. All right, we are getting all up in their face here with this. Oh my gosh, we got so much going on at this home beacon. Can we get out? Can we get one more flight? Oh my gosh, we get taken out. All right, so like, comment, subscribe, turn on the bell icon, and select all to enter and put your pilot ID, platform, and hashtag Tony200 Puncher into the comment section of any of my videos or content on YouTube from the 15th of January until the end of January. Here we go, we're dropping in the Erebus with the punchers. These suit any single robot that has a heavy slot um if it has a heavy slot you definitely want to be running a puncher on it um i've really really been enjoying this um this is a great counter for the revenants it's a great counter for the fafnirs it's a great counter for anything um m my favorite weapons of all time uh were the nucleon atomizer corker uh they were also 500 weapons just like these 500 meter range um, and they were also dual purpose weapons. Um, not only could you snipe and reach out to, you know, 500 meters to that deep mid range, but they also doubled as brawling weapons. And that's why I love these so much. Um, they're balanced in the regard that you have to be extremely accurate. Um, you have a very small amount of ammo and then you have a five second reload where you're left defenseless. So if you're not very accurate, if you're not hitting your shots, if you're not timing your reloads properly, you're going to be in a whole lot of trouble. Um, these took a little bit of getting used to uh, when I first got them. Oh my gosh, let's see if we can melt down this Revenant, man. Oh my gosh, we got him halfway. Let's see if we can drop him down to the last stand. Oh boy, look at that big healing on him. We got him right down to the last stand. We're reloading again, backing on up so he can't reach our shield now we're gonna walk into him now that we got our ammo back can we take him out boom we get the double kill that's what i'm talking about three full salvos of those weapons was enough to take out a revenant now that is a beautiful a beautiful thing ladies and gentlemen so we're gonna start creeping on up making our way down here to center beacon to have a presence in the middle of the map um we need to try to defend this and hold this they have a beacon bar advantage on us They're, they have almost twice the length of a beacon bar as we do uh, so we need to make sure that we're locking down and protecting these beacons that we do have. Just as I say that, one goes up for grabs. Hopefully my teammates are vigilant and get that back. Oh my gosh, look at that. We almost zapped that dude down so, so fast. Oh my gosh, we got a lot of attention. Boom, we get the Titan Slayer. That's what I'm talking about. We are getting lit up from a lot of different things right here. Trying to use this rock for cover. Um, mitigating some of the people's line of sights on me oh man could we get this dude up here waiting for this reload again oh man i know what that fast is going to take us out let me try to get this tightened down a little bit before i get taken out oh man no bueno no bueno there's an Al Al June. Al June. we're getting lit up so many different directions somehow we stood alive and we end up get taken out um man what a blast this thing's a ton of fun to play 
Now we're going to be dropping in with the old Sirene. Let's see if we can make something happen with this bad boy. This is a very fun robot as well. Let's see if we can take... Oh, man. Let me take out this Fafnir before he goes into flight. Nice. Teammate steals that kill, but it is all good. That dude needed to go. We could not allow him the chance to get off another flight. That would have been hugely detrimental to us. All right. Let's see what's going on. Let's take a big flight here. Let's see if we can get over this cover here. Light that dude up. We are not able to do so. Now we can... I teleported back. That guy was about to do his charge, as you see right there, and we would have got tossed either up onto the mountain or over into the gorge. You guys need to be very, very careful when you're landing around Minos like that. Many times when I've been landing in this siren, I did get launched all the way across the map or all the way into the gorge. I know I've been there. I learned my lesson. So now, when it's about to happen, I'll teleport back to my previous position. And see what I'm talking about? I get launched back as I'm trying to fall down. And this is what these Minos pilots do. So you need to be very conscious of this. Oh, that Death Survivor ability kicked in. I was able to get my ability the second time to protect myself. That is a very, very important skill to have on the Siren. I highly, highly recommend it. It saves my butt more times than I could explain. Um, it is a must, must have in my opinion. It's definitely, definitely worth it. All right, we're creeping up here. Uh, this friendly Minos, he's doing a great, great job. Hopefully, he can cap that beacon. Um, I wanted to see if I can get that mirror mess before he went into flight. I was not able to. That luchador comes down and lands over there. We're behind cover. Nice. We found our target. Letting our ammo reload. We're going to pop back behind cover. Let's see if we can take this mirror mess out. Lighten him up. Come on, baby. Boom. We get the Titan Slayer. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man. This bot is a ton of fun and it, with those punchers it definitely definitely packs a punch all right now we're going to drop in with our luchador we're going to jump in on this luchador and boom let's see if we can take him out quick can we take him out quick he's trying to jump i'm trying to blast him he's trying to get away and oh my gosh he yeets himself off the bridge <laughs> oh man that stinks i wanted to get that kill and i'm i know he didn't want to jump off the bridge like that jeez louise papa cheese all right, let's see. Where could we go next? Where could we go next? Oh, boy. Let's jump over here. It looks like we got a couple people. Boom. 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 Lighten them up. Lighten them up. Waiting for that shield to drop. And then we're going to start focusing on them. There we go. There we go. Taking them down quick, fast, in a hurry. Boom. We get our mothership healing as well. Titan Slayer. That's what I'm talking about. Drop that healing down on us as well. Okay, let's see if we can push up and push this dude off of our beacon here. Jumping up. Come down for the slam. Boom! Oh, nice, nice, nice. Both down very, very low at this point. Boom, we get the double kill. Oh, man, I get taken out before I can hit my reflector shield. But mission accomplished. We did some good, good work there. Um, we have four beacons now. Um, our beacon bar is extremely tiny. We need to hang on to all four of these to win this game right now, I believe. Oh, man, look at this Nightingale. Can we take him out? Come on, Nightingale. Boom, we get the kill. Yes, yes, yes. Very, very nice. Let's see. Top beacon is safe. It looks like all of the robots they have left are on their home beacon, and that's where we're going to have to try to keep them if we want to win this game. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Teleporting in. See if we can take this dude out. Boom, we get the double kill. Then we're going to try to finesse it, go back behind this cover while we reload. We don't want to stand out in the open and take unnecessary damage. Oh, man, they got lots of hawks in the air. Oh, my gosh, this is a coordinated team we're playing against right here. These guys know what they're doing. And another hawk, triple hawk action. I haven't seen this many hawks in a very, very long time. You guys remember the hawk era, the hawk meta? Jeez Louise, Papa Cheese. All right, let's see if we could take this dude out, teleporting on up to him. Boom, we get the triple kill. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man, they were able to get their top beacon back, unfortunately. But I can't push up too far because that'll leave an opening for them to get to center beacon. I need to have my presence here to keep their focus here. Oh, nice. Nice. Turning that beacon, and we get the victory at the final, final second. Oh, my gosh. What an amazing, amazing match. Let's take a look at the scoreboard. Oh, also, shout out to my clanmate, Morgan, a.k.a. Mudge, 
for being a, an excellent, excellent duo partner. Shout out to that one duo. You guys played a heck of a game. Appreciate you all. Hope everybody has a great day and keep coming back.